the Memphis Shades Road Warrior. How much wind does it take off your body? And does it take any wind off at all? That's what we're gonna talk about in today's video. I'm gonna roll the intro, get into it, baby. to another video guys all right so today we're gonna be talking about the memphis shades road warrior i've had this memphis shades road warrior on this bike uh, i'm gonna say going on almost two years right now one of my favorite fairings out on the market absolutely amazing um even after these almost two years um quality of it amazing has no chips on it i mean i have this little minor chip right here but that's from like a rock um but quality super amazing no cracks or anything like that thing is tough as hell now i do get asked a lot of questions about this fairing a lot of times it has to do with looks and everything because obviously there's a lot more fairings out there on the market um different styles smaller bigger whatever it may be different companies um so people always ask me what i think about the design and should they get it and what i think about it so far um and also the number one question that I get asked a lot mostly is does it really take off that wind off your body when you're riding and the answer to that is yes so huge huge difference um, you guys know this bike comes with a little bikini fairing in the front I was getting a ton of wind all over my chest my shoulders and I mean you know when you're out there hitting 80 plus miles out on the highway and it's like that wind's just hitting you you're you're not gonna you're not gonna feel comfortable to ride the way you really really want to ride out there, right? So after installing this fairing on, huge difference. Um, it takes all the wind off your chest, off your shoulders. I mean, yes, you are gonna get some wind that's gonna deflect on the top and maybe hit the top of your uh, helmet, a little bit of buffeting, but it's not that type of buffeting. Like let's say if you're like on a street glide and you get that crazy buffeting that you're not gonna get that so with that being said yes there's still gonna be wind that's gonna be coming in from the bottom from the sides whatever it is because at the end of the day you are on a motorcycle you are gonna have some type of wind but that big big amount that big pressure wind is gonna be hitting you that's gonna be holding you back when you're riding especially if you're gonna be where your hands up here you're not gonna get that anymore once you get this fairing right so it's a two-piece fairing right so it's a fairing right here with the windshield on top um, they all come in black. It matches perfectly with the black color on the Harleys. And you're also going to have the option for the windshields if you want a clear, a light smoke, or a dark smoke. Me in particular, I like the dark smoke. That's why I keep this on here. Um, and then you're also going to have different options for different sizing, right? So mine, another question which I get asked a lot is how tall is your windshield? So my windshield is 11 inches. Now you can go, they have a few more sizes up. I don't have them here right now, but there's a few more sizes that you can size up as well. Um, what I do recommend is maybe for like, for example, for the winter time or for you guys that are out there in these cold, cold states, um, get a clear windshield. If you're gonna be riding around this time, it is what, January right now, it's freezing cold. We're 30 degree weather, 20 teens, whatever it is. Get yourself a nice clear windshield that's gonna be really tall. So not 11, um, just real tall windshield. So that's gonna be able to take off even most of that stuff. So you probably won't be getting any buffeting at all. But is it gonna look as cool as a shorter one? No, but if, if you want protection from that cold wind, that's the way to go right there. I'm thinking about getting a tall, clear shield just for the winter time and I can swap out. Um, super easy to install as well. I've done a few install videos for these fairings. So you could type my name and put Memphis Shades, Marvel Kid 87, boom, it'll pop up. But super easy to install, super easy to take off. Two clips, you'll pull it off and it comes off. <clears throat> now, I also have this Del Rey right here. Del Rey is pretty nice as well. Smaller windshield, um, but it, you also do have the options of getting this in different sizes different uh shades as well this this shield is pretty cool um in the in the summertime is when i kind of like to alternate between them spring and summer alternate i put this on for a few weeks take it off put that on for a few weeks and it just latches in so as you can see right here this latches in to the hardware boom and it, it doesn't go anywhere 
Really, really strong stuff. Once it's in there, it's not coming off unless you're gonna take it off, right? Um, now, also I have this right here. You guys seen this on my Rogue Glide. Uh, really, really nice. This, I believe, is a nine inch, if I'm not mistaken. Um, so that's also a really, really nice uh, shield right there for your Rogue Glides. Um, also, if you guys, you fellas out there with Street Glides, you have that option as well. Um, and then for you guys with sporties, they have little different sporty uh, looking fairings as well. A ton of stuff on there. If you guys want to learn a little more about Memphis Shades, I'm going to be linking down the link to the website down below and see what they have. Um, super amazing stuff, high quality, and pretty simple. Got cobwebs there. Pretty simple to install and everything. Um, so A A plus. Doesn't it be it, guys? Just want to talk about that. Yes, it does work. It works tremendously. Trust me when I tell you guys. You know we keep it a buck in here. We keep it a hundred. It works, and most of all, it just looks great. It makes your bike look like really badass. Um, these things are really simple to paint as well. Uh, so if you want to go and get this. Get a paint job, they look amazing when people do paint jobs on the bike to match everything up. Looks super cool, man. That's gonna be it. If you guys do have any additional questions, drop them down below. Be sure to answer those nice and quickly, as efficient as I can. If you're new to my channel, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, hit that bell button so I notify you anytime I upload any type of content like this or anything else that you're into. Got a ton, a ton of cool stuff. Oh, I also have some big, huge news. Last week I did a video and I said I had some huge news, but now I got more new news to share with you guys, but I'll share that within a week or two as well. Huge stuff, some cool stuff coming to the channel. I can't even, <laughs> I can't even hold my, my smile back. It's like, uh, I just gotta, I'm just super happy, but some cool stuff coming to the channel, new content, new bike alert. You heard? <laughs> That's gonna be it guys. Like always, let the force be with you, ride safe, and enjoy the ride, baby. Peace.